Hello everybody, today I will speak about Windows, in particular the Windows that I have in my mini greenhouse. I just installed the second actuator for the window, the small window, that is the lower window of the greenhouse, and here is the result. We have the actuator and then the, the junction that go to the window. And here is the DC motor and the connection. For people that don't know which system I'm using, this is the Hydrosys 4 software. And I use some customized port to connect the pieces together. And it works with the adapter at 12 volts. And then we have the relays and I have two windows in this mini greenhouse setup and uh, one is controlled by a stepper motor and here we have the stepper motor oh the camera is just taking the picture now it will take two pictures one up and one down yeah so maybe I will get in the picture Anyway, I was speaking about stepper, yeah? right? The stepper motor, and uh, this is the controller for the stepper motor. The DC motor indeed doesn't require the controller, it just requires two of the relays to be set as H bridge configuration. And this is one of the setup of the IDOSIS for software. So, uh, let me show you also the, the other window, the big window. And here is the, the, the stepper motor, and there is the rod, and yeah, going up there, and it's connected to the window through this, in this way. Let me see if I can show you how it works in action, stepper motor test. Let's see. And this is how it works. And also we have a lower window, as I showed before. Let me see if I can get a good angle. Yes. And as you can see, this is opening now. Just a little. And uh, as the system is now set for automatic uh, temperature control, as the temperature is lower, uh, I will expect that within five minutes the window will close again automatically.